Hello everybody and welcome to a brand new Berry Reverse Criticism video. Today I'm picking up Pretty Pretty Plum Bob Sims aka Samantha. She left me her founders from her 100 baby challenge that she's doing over on her channel. If you guys are craving Berry Sims Let's Plays, go check out her channel. I'm gonna leave it in the video description. It's gonna be my first time working on a male sim. I'm awful. <laughs> But here's the thing, Ghetto is so cute. <laughs> he has such a jovial look to him. He just looks so young and so nice. And his color as a very sim was yellow, so I knew I wanted to make him a blonde. I ended up going with some brown eyes because his name, Ghetto, means cake in French. Also, I feel like I'm not saying it right. <laughs> Like, when I hear it, I hear Gato. But, like, th there's a few more letters there that I'm not reading, and that's why I'm not good at French. <laughs> and Gato in Portuguese is cat. <laughs> it it's messing with my brain. But going back to the Sim, I wanted at first to give him blue eyes, but I ended up going with the brown eyes, just because his name means cake. And I feel like some brown chocolate eyes are just what he needed to make him look even sweeter. Since he looks very young when it comes to his face, even though he's a father of many, I still wanted his style to look also very jovial, very young. I would say it's casual formal. <laughs> it's not too grown-ish, but I think that just suits him so well. So I'm gonna leave you guys to watch Gato's transformation. We're pretty much done anyways. <laughs> and I'm gonna come back once we pick up frosting. Since I'm going to be working on two sims, this is how we're doing it today. <laughs> and Gatos is all done. So we can move on to Frosting Sherbert. And Frosting, although she's a mother and her life is pretty hectic, she is a working lady. She is in the politician career, so I want her to look proper. But you know, as they are still a young couple, this is them before they had the babies. I still wanted them to look young. So I wanted something formal, but that would still look fun. Because after all, they're very sims. Her color as the very sim was purple, so I wanted to keep that color scheme going, but I did struggle a little bit with her. I knew from the start that I wanted to give her black hair and blue eyes. I find that combo really, really beautiful. But then when I started working on her outfits, I started to realize that I don't really have that many items in purple, at least not the ones that I had in mind for an outfit for her, which made me go back to the hair, try some other stuff, and then go back to the clothing, try some other stuff. I went in for a few loops, <laughs> it's just on her everyday outfit, just trying to see what would work best. Uh, I do figure it out, it's not purple, but her makeup is purple and blue and pink make purple. And there's nothing like a messy up to to tell you that she's a busy lady. Although her everyday look is not very purple, the rest of her outfits are. And I'm gonna leave you guys to watch through it. And I'm gonna be right back at the end to give you guys a look into all of her other outfits. So enjoy.
And here we have Luca and Violet. Samantha, if you are watching, I hope you enjoy their look. I don't know how you picture them as normal sims, but I hope I got pretty close. The CC list is gonna be in the video description, as well as the tray files, and these sims are gonna be in the gallery for download. I hope you guys enjoyed watching their transformation. I checked the gallery today, and there's so many more sims for me to work on. I'm gonna be busy. <laughs> If you want to leave a sim for me to transform into either a regular sim or a berry sim, share them to the gallery using the hashtag berryreverse. And until the next video, goodbye everybody, take care.